guys welcome back to my channel so today is a quick little project share i don't even know if it's a video response if maria is even requesting that but maria here on youtube is hosting a little giveaway challenge and you either had to make bows rosettes what did i make or flowers she's got my brain shot she is scrapbook nut 2002 here on youtube and for mine, I just went ahead and used the Marigold Collection by Crepe Paper. It does have pinks, um, black and whites, and then a lot of, most of them I haven't used yet because they are darker, darker hues. As you can see, some of the darker pages I haven't touched yet. But I did go ahead and use one of the green, green darker pages right here. And I went through and I stitched it and then I just used some of my Nouveau Mica Mist. This thing gets, it got, I used it once and then it clogged and I haven't been able to use it since. So I literally just unscrew it, put this on a piece of trash and kind of just fling, fling the stick on it to get some of the, as you can see, it's like metallic gold. It looks so dark in that bottle. I don't know why, but it's a really pretty color. It's an antique gold. And I did make some of these like flat flowers cause you know, I can't do rolled flowers. I did get this dye from AliExpress, so if it is still available, I will link it down below, but it just got the back piece and then the two layering pieces and it does come with a leaf, but I did not use that leaf. I used a different one, as you can see right here, from Ali as well, and it's got the three different sizes and then again, the three different sizes with like the holes in them. So I just layered those up and again, just like my other flower tutorial, I did use some uh, gauze in the background or you can use tool as well and then I did the same effect with this I uh, kind of sprayed the Nouveau Mist mica mist on there and then I added a little pink gemstone to the center of these ones use some foil gold leaves and I love the way that these turned out and for her challenge you do have to make the embellishments pastel color I know the background's not pastel but she's not counting that part uh oh is it a sticky um, so you only need to make one and that's it. You could submit this and that would be your entry. But I did go ahead and make some bows because I just, I, I don't know, I wanted to make bows too. So I did use my new AliExpress one, the one that like comes in with these little like, kind of looks like those pincher bugs and they come into the middle. The middle is very big. It's not like your normal size where you could stick like a little gemmy like that. So I got finally got to use some of my bigger like flat back cabochon. And so I just used like the flowers. I know this one was gifted to me, so I was able to use them. And then I just did pink paper. I stitched the back fishtail part of it. Again, I did the mica, mica mist on the back of this piece of paper and stitched it around. And then I'm including a little extra goodie because I, you guys, it's this year, I have so many um, drawers that say gift on it. Like I'm supposed to be gifting it. And I just, sometimes when I'm doing a swap, I like buy all this new stuff when I have a ton of stuff that it's like, if I don't start gifting it now, it's going to be like old school. <laughs> so I included some little mint flowers. She does love mint, like that minty color. So yeah, that is everything. I will leave her challenge down below. I think you have until the 31st, if I'm not right, of this month to get it in. So yeah. All right. Bye guys. Catch you in the next video.